Hey boys and girls. The question today comes from Martin and Martin asks, how can I stay in the moment? And this is the question that comes up over and over and over again. There's so much emphasis on mindfulness and rightly so. I mean, it's, it's an important part of our own development, our own growth. So much of it, whatever it happens to be for you, is all wrapped up in just showing up for your life. On the other hand, just being mindful of what's going on feels very passive and just being mindful might leave room for putting up with all kinds of dysfunction on a personal and a, a larger level. So we need a little bit more, but here's where we start. The trick to being really mindful, engaged and passionate, the trick to really being in the moment has to do with two things. That it has to do with being thankful and being of service. So instead of just thinking about, well, how can I really pay attention to what's going on? That's not enough. The trick is to say, how can I really give thanks for what's going on? The stuff that you really appreciate, learn how to give thanks for it. Really appreciate what's going on. And the stuff that you don't like too, learn how to give thanks for that as well. Because I'll tell you, that's the only way to get past it, to get over it, to get through it, is to say, this thing that I'm not crazy about, this person, this relationship, this situation, this whatever it is, is here to teach me something. And if I can learn from it, and if I can give back to it, if I can participate in that educational flow, I can get over it. Otherwise, it just keeps coming back and being mindful that it's hurting you isn't really all that helpful. It's a start, but it's not a finish. So once again, first of all, how can I be really thankful? How can I look whatever it is straight in the eye and say, thanks for showing up. Now, what can I do about this? And that's the second part. How can I use what's happening to me, what's happening through me to be of service? How can I serve? How can I help? In other words, life is giving you a gift Say thank you for the gift and then say, what can I do with this gift to move something forward? Big or small, doesn't matter. It can be a tiny little moment of growth, doesn't matter. How can I be of service? And if you can say thank you and if you can use what you've been given to move things forward, if you can serve, then you have to be in the moment. The more you practice the thankfulness and the service, the inflow and the outflow, the more you work on that, you will be mindful, you will be present, you will show up, whatever you wanna call it, as a natural byproduct. So stop paying attention to what's happening in my life. That's too superficial. Start paying attention to what can I give thanks for and what can I do about it? Because that action, that service, is what moves all of us forward. Thanks for moving forward with me. Thanks for sending in these amazing questions. Thank you for the subscription. Thank you for all the amazing feedback I have. And most of all, thank you for going to facebook.com slash Dita Randolph and clicking on that like button. We're at the beginning of something amazing. Thanks for being here with me. Take care of yourself.